Harry whisks Meghan Markle off to the French Riviera for a romantic New Year break. With its old-school glamour, year-round sunshine and beautiful beaches, it's no wonder Prince Harry has whisked his fiancé off to the French Riviera. But the royal couple's romantic New Year break began in a rather less chic fashion, on an economy flight with seats next to the toilets. Sources say the Prince and Meghan Markle flew out of Heathrow on New Year's Eve on a scheduled British Airways flight to Nice. In an attempt to remain incognito, the pair boarded their 9.55 amp flight before any other passengers and headed straight to the back of the plane, next to the rear toilets. They also took up three rows of economy seats, either side of the aisle, even though there were only themselves and three edgy and nervous bodyguards in their party. Harry, 33 apparently slumped down next to the window dressed in jeans, a jacket and with a baseball cap pulled over his face. Bride-to-be Miss Markle, 36, was sitting next to him in a black beanie hat and minimal makeup. According to one fellow traveler, the aircraft actually took off several minutes early, much to the surprise of other passengers, and shaved 20 minutes off its two-hour flight time. And if anyone hadn't spotted the group by that point, they couldn't mistake the two heavily armed officers from the French border police waiting for the party as they disembarked, ready to whisk them out through the VIP area. Other sources have told the Mail that several members of France's elite service de la protection, the police unit responsible for the protection of foreign dignitaries, had flown down from Paris to guard the couple during their stay. Asked if Kensington Palace had requested them, they said, no, it would have been offered and would have been non-negotiable. After what happened to his mother in this country and the issue of terrorism, it would be insisted on even for a private trip such as this. All officers within the force are armed with a Beretta M9, while at least one of them would also have a machine gun. It is understood that Harry and Miss Markle flew out to celebrate the New Year with friends and plan to stay several days at a private residence in the Riviera region. The weather is perfect for a short break, sunny and a pleasant 15C59F. By flying frugally, Harry is following in his brother's footsteps. In 2014, Prince William delighted passengers when he shunned first class on a flight from New York to Washington, D.C., where he had met President Obama at the White House. Earlier the same year, he flew from Memphis to Dallas in coach class as he returned from his friend Guy Pelley's wedding. The trip to the south of France may well be a welcome break for Harry and Miss Markle before wedding preparations begin in earnest. One decision that has already been made is the catering firm they will use for their main nuptials. While royal household staff will man and cater the main event, and will be paid for by the Queen and Prince Charles privately, the couple have also employed society favorite table talk, most probably for the evening reception. The firm has royal pedigree, it was used by Prince William and the Duchess of Cambridge for their 2011 wedding and by Kate's sister, Pitha Middleton, when she married last year. Kensington Palace declined to comment last night.